so uh, this first question is from uh, times of india uh, which uh, says this is your first time in mumbai indians how does it feel to be bowling with jaspreet at the other end do you think that he is the best bowler in the world at the moment uh, yeah obviously it's uh, uh, my first experience with the mumbai family um, I'm really enjoying it so far. Obviously, we've only played one game uh, to date, but um, yeah, the opportunity to bowl with uh, Boomer, um, you know, and the likes of the, the other guys in the bowling attack as well is, is very exciting. It's um, a good opportunity to learn, and um, yeah, Boomer's a guy that's very experienced. Um, he's got some amazing skills, and uh, no, I'm really looking forward to hopefully having some success with him. Right. Uh, the second one is from Hindustan Times. Your first game for Mumbai started well. Uh, with the wicket, but it didn't end it well. Uh, assessment of your performance after the first match and areas which you and bowling unit need to work on. I think from from my point of view personally, uh, coming off a big winter in New Zealand, obviously with lockdowns and isolations and stuff that like that, I haven't played cricket in, in probably six months. So I was pretty happy with the way it came out. Um, obviously conditions that are a lot different to what I face back home with the heat and the humidity here. But um, yeah, I, I think we're. We were a couple of runs short uh, in terms of our total to, to defend. Um, yeah, and um, coming into bowl last over with they need five runs, so I don't think there's much I can do about that. But um, yeah, I think it's a good good place to start from. Uh, I think we can tighten up in a couple of small areas with, with accuracy and execution, and, and that's what we'll look to do over the next couple of games. Okay, there's a continuation to this question. Uh, is about the challenges of bowling in death over, and uh, how does one tackle them? I think it's a... Uh, the biggest challenge in the game to be honest. I think it's very difficult coming in and bowling the last couple of overs against a batsman that's set. Um, Duplicy was set the other night on 50 or 60 runs and you know when guys are hitting from that, that platform it's, it's very hard to defend but uh, personally I want to try to stick to my strengths, um, you know try execute Yorkers and, and take the pace off it and um, just try to be a step ahead of the batsman but it's definitely the biggest challenge in T20 cricket and um, I'm looking forward to embracing it. All right. Uh, similar to this is from AVP in Calcutta. Your thoughts on possible duel with Andrew Russell uh, in the in the death over? How do you keep him quiet? I think he's one of the most destructive batsmen in in the game at the moment, and um, therein lies the challenge. Um, that's personally why I play the game. I've probably been quoted it uh, before. Uh, I like to to take on the big players and and look to take their wickets, so uh, I'll be looking forward to that challenge. I'm sure I'll face it uh, at some st stage in this tournament, but um, yeah, he's a, a very exciting player, so we'll need to research well and, and make sure we're on the ball. Okay. Uh, Middy, Middy wants to ask you about, uh, did, did uh, Bumbra, uh, Bumbra spell, and he went uh, quite expensive, did it surprise you? Uh, no, it didn't, didn't surprise me. Obviously, he's a, he's a world-class bowler. Um, yeah, uh, I think the, the no ball, he probably obviously isn't trying to overstep the mark there, but that was, that was a big ball. Um, yeah, I know he's worked very hard over the last couple of days to, to find that rhythm, and yeah, I'm 100% sure he's going to be on the mark over the next coming game. So he's a big player for us, um, very, very important bowler, and uh, I'm sure we'll see him bounce back very nicely. Uh, <clears throat> PTA wants to ask... Uh, uh, IPL has seen three matches till now and uh, quite more or less the template has been set where you win, uh, you, you know, you win the toss and you select the ball. So uh, what are your thoughts on, 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 uh, on this template? Um, yeah, I think it's, it's very early in the tournament. I think the most exciting bit is that there's been uh, three amazing games to start this tournament. Um, I, I'm presuming the wickets are going to change, uh, not drastically, but they will deteriorate over the, the next couple of months really. Um, it's very hot here. Um, the day games will be interesting to follow, but um, yeah, with the heat and the humidity and how the wicket seems to quicken up a little bit under lights, um, yeah, it looks like it's a, a better time to bat. But um, whatever we do first, we need to do it well. And um, obviously, it's um, from my point of view, I just want to be on the mark with the ball and, and look to take wickets. Right. Uh, Ian, I wants to ask: uh, the UAE wickets were expected to help Sinner, but you had a good time against CSK. Is the wicket is the wicket theory more myth or is it really spin friendly? Is the wicket what? More of a myth? Oh, a myth. Or or a spin friendly? Um, yeah, I think like I said before, the, the wickets are going to change throughout the tournament. But um, from what we experienced the other night, the humidity, the ball definitely swung around a little bit. And being early in the tournament, they are fresh wickets. So from my point of view, I'd love to see them as a 
uh, swinging friendly conditions with, with a bit of pace in the wicket. But um, yeah, I think the teams that are adjusting, is, well, adjusting quicker um, and assessing those conditions uh, early as possible are, are going to be the successful ones. So that's what we'll look to do and um, look to try to stay ahead of our opposition. How do, how do you see the, uh, Dubai wicket and uh, uh, the Abu Dhabi wicket? Does it uh, boost your morale in terms of uh, uh, helping you? Yeah, I've, I've only experienced the Abu Dhabi wicket. I haven't seen much of the other games, but um, I've bowled a little bit in Dubai. But um, yeah, I've, I understand that wickets can, can change drastically uh, in these conditions. 